Well, that was a fucking kerfuffle. <laughs> hey, Sarge got it done. We're still here, aren't we? I suppose. Eight men standing against the Nazi gun fort. Richard said I'd gone mad. Sometimes, a little madness is called for. Yep, yep. yep. I think deep down he understood that. And realized we were cut from the same cloth. So it seems like I'm using all the German guns. Like, do we not have an M1 Gram? Like, you don't have an MP40. Baby, reload this. A bar only holds 30 rounds for extended mags. <laughs> what a rip! A stand down. Nah, I like this thing. Yeah, give me those. How's man. it looking, Sergeant? You don't need those. Let's see for yourself. Let's get you the lay of the land. Our targets are the guns housed in those casemates. And we can only get there God, through a horde of Germans this. armed to the teeth. Oh, that doesn't look good. Think you can handle taking out the lower gun? I fancy my chances. That's that a lot of dudes. Way in, but it's packed with MGs. Yeah, it's packed with a whole push. bunch of people too. First job's getting across that minefield. But that anti-tank ditch could be useful. I've got an idea. I'm all ears. We can punch a hole through the mines with those blitzers there. And the bunker will make mince meat out of us as soon as they hear the engines coming. We're going quiet then. No engines. Better the last second, let gravity do the work. That should get us to the ditch at least. Well, you're mad, you know. I love it, but I think you should go first. <laughs> All right then. Dig as soon as you hit the ditch, <laughs> get the men ready. That's Tommy, totally fair. You with me? Oh yeah. Drive through the minefield, take the bunker, strap some thermite to some highly explosive weapons. Piece of piss, Sarge. And you, get a second sun burning in the sky. If our ships don't see that flare, if they don't know we've won, they'll fire on the guns and risk taking us with them. Well, I don't know about you, but I think I'll take very little consolation in knowing that the fire that killed me was friendly. Yeah, that would suck. Don't worry, Gov. I won't forget to aim up. Okay. Godspeed, Sure, Buck. Was it? He's gone. He's just, Get he's up, man. Gone. Time to move. Ah, what 
the fuck? Kick his ass, boys! We almost just died! That's my teammate. Case, mates. I'll take the upper one. Don't forget the flare. Let's move up. Let's search. Oh, wait, boys, this is it. Wait. You're on me. Wait, wait, I said. Tommy! Try get back. We need to clear the door. All right, lads. Up of you. With me. It's a bad idea. Press it fire now. Jesus Christ. Oh, no. No, no, no. no. Take that. Oh. Did not see the third person sitting in a friggin' little tiny hut. <laughs> Typical Call of Duty. Press it fire now! Bad idea. Man, this bar is on kicks like a meal. Take out the hard track. Here we go. She's out. They're falling back. Keep pushing. Get out of my way, please. I'm trying to win the war. Thank you. Hold the line! Use the half tracks for cover! Push! Over there! Take them out! Oh my god, this is a massacre. Those MGs are target. Move this thing now. Stick on it, lads. Stay covered. Almost there. I'm pretty sure that's an enemy's head. I'm shooting, man. Damn it! All I had to do was sit behind.
Do, 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 do. Over the top. Clear the hole. Stay back. Toss the 77. Right, 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 right. Oh, whoops, sorry. Hmm. Sorry, teammate. Eyes on that door! What's the door? Oh, Evans, oh, right. take point! I'll cover ahead while you find a torch, Sarge. Got it, Sarge! Bloody hell, it stinks in here. Sarge! <laughs> no, let it go, bud. You're fine. You're fine. You're dead. Up ahead now. Take it easy. Monster. Yeah, this could have really destroyed some things, eh? Never seen a 125 up close before. Let's blast the bastard, Sarge. Will do. Throw a mic grenade. Nice. One down, one to go. That's the last of the thermite. Sarge, we could use your help here. Whatever you do, don't get shot in the head. Thank God. Barely see that last there. guy that died in the head shot, man, that was Take rough. That poor guy. He didn't see it coming. up? No kidding, bud. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> he got that? <laughs> okay, don't die, don't die, don't die. No whammies, no whammies when you open this door. Hey, yo, you got grenades. Now every crowd knows we're here. Um, do you hear that? Most likely Phillips dies. There's no way he doesn't. He's not really God, that was close. I'm tired Take of saving charge. you. Stay Let me go up. first. Get down! Shit. You should have died again. Like Webb did his part. The rest is up to us. Okay, last door. Come on. Nice. Way to hit him with the shoulder. Shit! Take cover! Good name. Oh no, I have the wrong gun out. Case made is clear. <sighs> How are we blasting this one? We're out of thermite. I'll feed it a Bangalore. A what? <laughs> Let's get up top before this thing explodes. You have the flare, Sarge? Bombardment's close. Flare. Let's get her done, bud. Flare up. Sergeant, uh, the flare. Bombardment's any minute. Damn! Flare's ruptured. You've got to be fucking joking. Where's Webb? There. Lower case, mate. Incoming! Get down! Wait for Webb's flare! Get everyone to cover! We need to run for it! Shit. Oh, shit. Come on. 
little man, run! Why can't we run, dude? What? What? Pick up that flare. Don't worry about Webb. Pick up the flare. Pick up the flare. Where the hell have you been? Funny time to take a kip. I was just waiting for some mad bastard to come and save the day. Well, let's you and I signal our boy, shall we? You're taking a lot of time here, bud. Oh my god. We'd lost our captain, but we'd won the day. And we'd honored the memory of all those we lost the only way we could by completing the mission. You look at the soldiers under your command and hope that they can do the difficult thing, the impossible thing. That flare told me I'd been right. This is what it means to be a leader. All right, big bet. Not bad, I like that idea. From all the flags waving on the streets, we'd never have known the Nazis were about to lose the war. But bullies are always loudest when they're scared. And when they're desperate, they get stupid. Commander Hermann Freisinger had killed Novak. Then he'd given us a free ride, right into the lion's den. That's that one actor. I've read the field report twice. This Allied team is fascinating. They have been captured. But it was too close. I want you to find out everything you can about this unit. It will be my pleasure, sir. You will speak of this to no one else and report directly to me. Al Hitler. I actually like these cutscenes like this though. They're pretty dope. And they have really good graphics in the Christ, cutscenes. what is that smell? Chlorine dioxide. They think it hides the smell of death. So, iron, iron! Exact the baby, baby! At least I got beds for you guys, fuck. Well, this is the nicest shit all I've ever been in. Is anyone else hungry? Palina, the eggs is all honey. Da, scores of the car. Your vision. So? I am Hauptsturmführer Richter and... Piss off, crowd. Unless you got room service for us. And I have questions for you. How are we gonna eat bloody questions? I'm the commanding officer. You'll speak with me. Even then, Richter was easy to read. Uniforms at high rank, no combat medals, office rat. The perfect mark. Surrounded by three guards, all armed, and all wankers. And <laughs> all oh, wankers. Awesome. I'm assuming that means all that they're my studying the allies. I have never come across such an unusual unit. Kingsley, Arthur, Lieutenant, service number 2523. Two six four two. I'll tell you a story. I have spoken with the Führer on exactly one occasion. He recommended a book to me, The Passing of the Great Race, by an American, a man named Madison Grant. The Führer had nothing but praise for him. Fuck Madison Grant. And everyone like him. The book reveals that under extreme duress or unfavorable conditions, your people do not deteriorate so easily. In that moment, I knew what I had to do. Right to the suprasternal notch, below the clavicle. Once we had what we needed from this racist bastard, that's where I would put my knife. 
my plan began to take shape. We were being held in the basement of Gestapo headquarters. Around and above us was a treasure trove of classified Nazi intelligence. Project Phoenix had to be there somewhere, and Richter was our ticket. He thought he was the interrogator. If he was to be of any use to us, he'd have to keep thinking that. That arrogant Nazi in his clean-pressed uniform loved the sound of his own voice. The hard part wouldn't be fooling Richter into spilling what he knew of Project Phoenix. I would like to see for myself. Well, that's a hammer. But the hard part would be convincing the others not to kill him first. The Allies somehow knew about Project Phoenix. We must have a traitor amongst the officers. I pulled their files. Take care of them with the other non-essentials. It's one hell of a picture back there. Lieutenant Kingsley mentioned a Project Phoenix. Likely Allied propaganda. The Negro thought he was protecting his team. No doubt to prove himself. To make him their leader. The Allies must have been desperate. <laughs> he said it was their first mission. That his sixth man is dead. He's probably lying. I will uncover the truth. But the other teams like this one. How did they learn of Hamburg? Is Tempelhof at risk of being compromised? These are the things I need to know. There's more at stake here than I'm at liberty to discuss. Just know that I'm counting on you, Herr Richter. I understand. Thank you. So. He doesn't trust We have your friends by the door, you tough! Well, I see ten fingers. That's a good sign, at least. Now make a bus. I'm fine. Listen. They know about Wade. But they haven't caught him yet. You told him he was killed, didn't you? On the train to Hamburg. I don't think they'll fall for it. But the hope is it'll buy him some time to get us out. He isn't coming back for us. He's right, Kingsley. We can't count on that fucking drone guy. Bring out the girl. She ain't going nowhere, mate. I'll just get out of my way. Oh. <laughs> Alina, Nikolai's name. Whose name is Yoshtomoshish? 